what is happening people hey guys we at the lake today hey we're gonna do a little crappy fishing today that'll be in a different video right now i'm gonna share something with you that made my life much easier launching and and loading my boat it is a boat to trailer hitch and i decided on the boat to trailer just because i researched the different types that's what I chose. I encourage you to do the same. So let's take a look at it. Uh, so you can see here, this is the boat to trailer hitch. Uh, this is my release latch here. It has a guide wheel on the top. It has this hard plastic here. And of course the latch is right up underneath here. And I and you still use your boat winch to hook it to the eye under the boat. Now, I came down a little earlier and uh, filmed this uh, loading and unloading on the boat. And this has made my life so much easier. I normally back in close to the dock that you see here. I walk down the dock, get in the boat, come up, and I pull this latch here. And it unlatches the boat and it floats off. Makes my life much easier than having to lean over, lean over the bow of this boat here, reach under there and unhook it. So just briefly, I'm gonna demonstrate just how easy it is to launch your boat with this boat trailer hit. For the most part, I am going to undo this latch here. This is my normal boat latch. Just drop it down. The boat will stay latched while I get in the truck. Now, one of the things that I do while I back this boat into the water is I, since I have this hitch on here, I need to get it a little bit deeper than I normally would. Like normally it's right at the top of the fender wells. And that also will depend on the uh, pitch of your ramp. This one has a 14, 14 degree pitch. And so it's fairly steep. What I like about it, see the boat is still, uh, is still attached here. And I don't have to worry about it going anywhere. Rear end of the boat is floating. Easy step across, up to the front. I can tie a string to this if I want to and come back in the boat and pull it, but it's pretty simple that uh, it just floats backwards here. And boom, we just launched our boat. Now I'm going to film reversing that and actually real time loading that uh, in just a few minutes when we get back from fishing. So let's go catch a fish. And this is a locking mechanism that locks onto the boat. So the eye of the boat comes up and trips trips that on there see it moving and you have to hit it kind of hard to get it to trip and then it latches in all right guys as promised we're gonna i'm gonna put this gopro on my hat and show you how i load my boat with this and and how actually it latches and what you need to do It's pretty simple. Normally I get my trailer a little bit deeper than I normally would traditionally. <clears throat> As 
So normally you're gonna let you're gonna let the boat settle in. So did you so did you hear that audible snap latch? That's what you're looking for, that snap. So basically the boat is latched. I can come back, step out of the boat. I don't have to worry about going to the front and uh latching the boat. So guys, I know in the comments, you're going to comment which boat to trailer hitch that I need for my boat. And I'm not going to try to guess that. You can go to their website, boat to trailer web. You can go to the boat to trailer website and you can look at all the different bows of the boats to see which application actually fits your boat. Um, now, they do not sponsor me. Hey, if they want to, they can reach out, but they don't sponsor me. But this boat to trailer hitch latch has really improved my launching and unlaunching. So, guys, I hope you've seen something in the video that helped you. I hope you've seen something in the video that you learned. Uh, don't forget to hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel. Hey, it's free. And, guys, you remember, it's a wild life, and I'll see you on the water.